Oh, hello. Hello again. I have a request uh, of your robot, your doti, your... Am I saying this right? My personal manservant. Your personal manservant. Yes. Um, could he draw some things for me? Uh, in Gnome, I say. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Absolutely, milady. Whatever you would request. You are a milady. We totally called it. <laughs> <laughs> Continue. <laughs> Um, and in common, I say back, thank you so much. Um, uh, Dodie, would you mind drawing portraits for me? Looks back to you, Tyrion. Do whatever the young lady asks. Mm-hmm. Pulls the uh, book out. Could you, could you draw some portraits? of this group, of, of, of Grog, of Vax and Vex, Keyleth and Percy. Just a little bit of a note here. He doesn't know who any of those people are. Okay. Yeah, you, you point out to where they're all staying. When yeah. you're all done, just bring them to me. Is there any Thank particular you so style you'd like them to be drawn in? Just as realistic as possible. Realism. Realism. Each of you individually wakes up in the wee hours as a sound rouses you from your slumber. As you glance over in one of the nearby open windowed walls, you see a large metallic man shape appear (laughs) and just start feverishly sketching while staring at you. (laughs) One by one by one by one. (laughs) He likes to watch. That was Terry's fault. Automaton. <laughs> Dude, I'm so, not dreaming. Yeah. I'm okay. Not yeah. Does oh, anyone try geez. to talk to the automaton? I, I think <laughs> we just stay perfectly still yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and try and lift our chin and push forward. Dude, it looks like a good angle at least. <laughs> <laughs> I slowly pull the sheet a little higher. <laughs> I pull the I, sheet I, a little lower. <laughs> <laughs> And Dodie continues sketching, adjusting to the new positions. As you approach to, to speak to everybody, suddenly from the side, Dodie seems to just slam into view like some weird hype man. Um, hype man! <laughs> and really just like hands you a fist, a, a, a metallic fist filled of, of pages torn out of the tome. <laughs> Thank you so much. And then runs off towards Tarion. Terry. Come here. Who, oh, me? Yes, you. <laughs> Couldn't be. <laughs> Hello. Hello. So I figured you would have a little bit of an easier time if you know the names of the people that you're spending time with. Hmm. I. Had him make you some, I don't know, maybe some flashcards. So, oh I take out a quill. Okay. I hold up a photo. Who is this? What oh. you see before you <laughs> is a very beautifully, realistically drawn image of uh, a female half elven druid and a male half elven <laughs> rogue paladin, both clutching bed sheets, going. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. In the same drawing. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but how did. I mean, they would have had to have been. <laughs> I didn't realize he was going to draw them in their sleep. So let's just, let's just. (coughs) Please go through every picture. (laughs) I, uh, so many more questions than answers. (laughs) 
<laughs> One of those two was dead yesterday, and yet they still found time to. Well, uh, the one on the left uh, is. I lovingly refer to her as Antlers. She is the most powerful and leader of the group. All those things are, are true, but um, take this, this quilt. Now, next to her, next to her picture, please write Keyleth. Dodie, you heard her. No, huh? no, no, <laughs> no, no. no. <laughs> Dodie stops when she says no. You are going to write it down. Mama Do you know how to write? Of course I know how to write. Okay, I'm an I, educated I man. Oh God, does he know how to write? <gasps> In what language? <laughs> what language do you prefer? I prefer gnome when I'm with, the, with you. <laughs> oh. Old habits okay. die hard. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's good practice. <laughs> okay. So write down Keila. Hmm. Odd. Vowel sounds in your weird language. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He left. The man laying next to her. Mm hmm. Do you know his name? Little Elf Boy. <laughs> I would never say that again. <laughs> his name is Vax. With a B? Like Bax? With a V, as in. <laughs> Vagina. Vagina. <laughs> Mana from heaven. Mana from heaven. Got it? Uh, oh, X. All right. Next up. You know what? That one sounds familiar. I feel like he's introduced himself to me. Okay, next up, who's this? Uh, this is another pair. Um, <laughs> this, this one. <laughs> Oops, Less shy. <laughs> it appears to be a, a a human male, looking confused, with glasses pressed up above the top of the forehead, and uh, a half elven, dark haired uh, female on top, <laughs> glancing back with a "Don't you fucking dare" expression. <laughs> oh, oh well. <laughs> Yes, I, I know, you're learning so much. <laughs> may, may I for a moment? <laughs> sure. Do you, do you think this is up, or? <laughs> you could have it any way you like it. <laughs> <coughs> I've read about that. Uh, all right. Just looking at the faces, then, who do you think they are? <laughs> Uh, the, uh, the happy one is Little Elf Girl. Oh, I would definitely not ever say that to her. <laughs> uh, all right, uh, what's her real name? Her name is Vex. Hmm. All right, Vex. And do you know that her and Vex are twin brother and sister? I could tell by the bone structure and okay. the contempt. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. 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 Now, <laughs> the man laying next to her, what is his name? Percival Frederickstein von Musel Carollo de Rolo III. Well done! Almost! Oh, Almost! Oh, Almost! Oh, Almost. Oh, Kowalski de Rolo III. So Percival, Percival Frederickstein von Musel. Muslix. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so close! You know, the Kowalski <laughs> Kowalski to roll over the That one is bullshit. That one depends on how much whiskey. That's fair. Please That's write a it down. whiskey based pronunciation. <sighs> that one I'm going to do in common. <laughs> and you know what? I'll just abbreviate the middle part. That's okay. <laughs> Dot, 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 de Rolo. <laughs> Two more to go. Who's this? Okay. <laughs> Let's see, of, of the... Uh... All right, so there is there is one of, uh, this one is is Pike, um, in a, in a, a her gnomish form, uh, still wearing her armor in her astral form, um, just kind of looking 
like she realized she didn't phrase it properly when she made the request, <laughs> and being the last one sketched, and that moment, her expression says, oh no. <laughs> Before I answer, uh, uh, answer. Um, just a quick process question here. Okay. In the other images, there was some revelry, some intercourse happening. Um, is that, now that I'm a full-fledged member, do I, do I get to partake? Is this how it works with everyone, or is it just certain members? Is it a hierarchy? Is it some sort of a... No. A cultish oh thing God. where you have to prove yourself sexually and in battle, or how does that work? Or is it. Am I misreading this? You know, I think you should just continue to, to try to explore that. <laughs> because wow. it would just be great just to see what happens. You never know, Terry. You just never know. All right. I uh, would never tell you no. <gasps> no! Not you! <laughs> not even face! I would never tell you no to not try with, with, the, with, the, with the people of the group. <laughs> so you're saying that membership has its privileges. <laughs> Mayhaps. <laughs> oh my God. Do you know my name? Uh, daughter of Saren Ray, I'm guessing. No, it's Pike. Hmm. Pike. And last but certainly not least. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Nary. Doty, she said realism. <laughs> realism. <laughs> <laughs> And there, in a, in a classic Michelangelo-style pose, one knee cocked to the side, the beard fluffed, the rippling scarred muscles, and the obvious half-giant side of Grog Strongjaw before you on the page. That is not a picture of a Goliath and a halfling. I mean, how does he walk? <laughs> With confidence and pride. Pick a leg. Yes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. I know. That is just. That is primal. You took some, <laughs> some artistic liberties with this one. Oh. <laughs> Made it smaller. All right. Uh, I've been taking to calling him Jumbo or the big guy. Okay. And it seems that I was correct. <laughs> <laughs> well, this, too far. this is Grog. So, say that again. Grog. Grog. Okay. And that is my very best friend. You know, I have learned that he is a confident ally and a friend to me as well. And I will do my best to protect him in battle in your absence. Well... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that is very, very kind of you. Oh. So, before I leave, my request is that you look at these every night before bed until you learn them. <laughs> I love, I love, I love. love Mama Pike. Can you, in this form, can you see me all the time? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I will. So I will know <laughs> if you're not looking at your flashcards every night. <laughs> <laughs> this is so stupid. This is Dungeons and Dragons. This is amazing. <laughs> Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> Milady, I swear it by my name. I will do so as you request. Thank you for saving one of my allies today. And wherever you are in the world, know that we are fighting the good fight, and I will keep your friends safe. Your friends, Greg, nope. Vox, <laughs> Vox, <laughs> Kiko, Kiko works. and Percival, Frederick Steen, Von Musel, Kowalski, Dorolo, the country. Yay. Yay. 
realized that was off of memory, so I'm going to let it slide. I have yes. a few more nights of studying to do. You do. Okay. 